Okay, I'm going to demonstrate the floor slide exercise. It's a shoulder patterning exercise, really similar to the wall slide. We just do this because in my gym and we work with some athletes, you just don't have good wall space to do the wall slide. So if you can, do the wall slide. If not, this is just an alternative. And you just do the same thing pretty much on the floor. Just lay on the floor and uh, get your feet in the sit-up position like that. It's really important that your head, your shoulder blades, and your lower back is squishing to the floor. So if you have an arch in your back, you can put your hand back there, you're not doing it right. You make sure that everything's squished down. Your butt, tailbone, your lower back, your shoulders, and your head. And then you just take your hands and just go like this. You want your elbows, your wrists, and your hands to touch the ground the whole time. Then just go up as far as you can. And then bring them down as far as you can. You're trying to keep the elbows, the wrists, and the hands touching the floor the whole time. You kind of see me struggle like this. It's harder than it looks. Again, it's just a patterning exercise. We're trying to keep the scapula, train the scapula to move correctly behind your back. And this is just an exercise to help do that. So if we say three reps, just go up and down as far as you can three times. That's the force line.